We come to it at last. Ooh, here we go again. Conquest. Last argument of kings. I am Tycho, and with my friend Nick, get to present a 1,500-point battle for you today. Because you're playing something new today. I oh, am. Yeah. Like yes, creepy yes. clone the aliens. Spire. yes. This is probably the most unique fantasy army I've ever seen. This is a really, really cool lore dive if you want to go into it <laughs> on Parabellum.com. There's uh, a lot to, to, to get into with the Spire. But needless to say, we clone armies to create monsters to destroy our foes with. My supremacy ability uh, on my high clone executioner is coordinated assault. Oh, you get three activations all at once. All at once. That's really good. It's really good. Only once for battle, though, right? Only once for battle. So watch out for that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm playing the Dweg home. I've got all the dwarven goodness here. Shoulder mounted cannons. Dude. I've got automata that, like, are made of fire and magma. They're full of demons. I've got some really heavy hitting stuff, good defense, great offense. The king of my forces has decided to step back and let the tempered steel shaper take command. What makes him so special as a commander? Okay, it's really cool. Once per battle, I can uh, heal four wounds across my entire army. When you are down, you're not out. And my guys are tough to begin with. Right. And you just fill the wounds with like molten metal and get back up. <laughs> if you want to play, and we know you do, help us out by using the affiliate link here or in the description below. Upstart Spire nobles have conspired to gain access to Dweg home held trade routes by sending pheromone perfumed envoys. They failed. Unfortunately, we did not oh. know about oh. Dweg niceties. We said no! Well, we, you offered us a tankard. We refused. You insulted our mother. Deeply. When words fail, conquest. You have noticed an army marching in your borders and have come to meet me in the maelstrom. <laughs> the Maelstrom is a scenario where we have three objectives. The heads of my, my fallen envoys. The heads right here, the lower torso's here, Oh god! and uh, the limbs over here. Between turns one and four, or nine and ten, you score two victory points for holding the middle, and one victory point for holding the outside. But between turns five and eight, it reverses. Oh. So the outsides become more important. So initially we're all charging into the center to try to get points, but after that the outsides become more important. Now this side of the map is to be a little bit harder for us to access, as in this deployment edge has been blocked off. So we can only come in on this side and from our backs of our deployment zones. 12 victory points ends the game. All right. Or 10 rounds. You can also win the game by destroying all of your opponents. I think let's go for that. Let's just kill them all. <laughs> So I've got, I've got two possible light units that could come in here. I have two, one is a flanker, comes in automatically. All right, here we go, on three ups. Hoorah! I got both! Come on. So we both got both units coming in. Roll off to see who has supremacy. Supremacy! supremacy. Now, technically, you have a modifier of one on this. Because you have more cards than I do. I do. Oh. Supremacy of five! Ha. You get to do the first activation. Force grown drones. So I'm going to be double marching for 11 inches. Here goes, sir. All right, so my first activation is the Inferno Automata. Oh, how did I guess? So double move. All right, what do you got next? More drones. Little drones, fit for the slaughter. Next unit. The Tempered Sorcerer. The Tempered Sorcerer who's not here. He's not here. That might have been a mistake. Yeah. Tempered Sorcerer does nothing. My Biomancer uh, has nothing to heal, so he's okay. All right. And then lastly, my Hold Ballista. That is holding the Tempered Sorcerer. I see. They move twice. So I can put these guys all the way here. My High Clone Executioner is my last draw. He's not gonna pull any shenanigans right now. And that was turn one. That was turn one. Look at that, nice and quick. Now it gets interesting. So now we're close enough to start doing some damage, but also there's a chance of some more stuff coming in. Some interesting stuff. I've now got the Tempered Steel Shaper coming in. Tempered in his Steel. unit of Fire Forge, shoulder-mounted cannons. I see. <laughs> um, and my Hold Warriors. What do you have potentially coming in, Tycho? Coming in on my side, there's a whole lot of possibilities. Vanguard clones, Marksman clones, Avatara, and my Lineage Highborn. 
the noble herself. So I've only got two rolls to make. Four. I got one. None. You got none? All right, so now I gotta build my deck. Interesting, what do I wanna do? Supremacy. Who goes first? I want you to go first. I rolled a one. A one. So you go first. Oh, I don't wanna go first. First thing coming on is the Fire Forged. Oh, you may have out outwitted me anyway. So they're gonna go like this. You know like what? They have... Their beards are so big, I think oh. they just like stuff their beards maybe into the ear. Oh. I can I, see that. My wife tells me that's what I do. <laughs> Drones. It wasn't what I was initially thinking I was gonna do. But I, I'm trying to be tricksy, so this is gonna be a double march. Ooh, that puts you in tempting charge range. That's the idea. Do a bit of a dangle. A dangle is a trap set by leaving a unit seemingly exposed as bait. In this example, I had a unit poised to punish a successful charge. I gotta get a five. <laughs> so it's certainly not a gimme charge. The Inferno Automata. The Inferno Automata. You guessed right that I'm doing these guys next. Yeah. You know what? I'm not gonna go for the bait. No? No. Oh, come on. No, because a five, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna make it. But what I am gonna do is I'm gonna double march over here. Nick may have avoided my trap, but he will not get away easily. My high clone executioner, who's gonna do double time upon his unit. So that means I'm gonna get a total of three movement actions, 16 inches uh, of movement. You got two within, I got three. So I'm gonna get myself two victory points. The whole ballista. Ooh. So, you're actually in range. So we're gonna aim first for my first action. Second action, we're gonna fire everything into there. How unfortunate. Yay! <laughs> Five hits. Just stop your crossbow. Getting ones. I got one, one. So I killed four of them. Tempered Sorcerer with four dice. Nothing for you. So two more dead. What's your response? My Biomancer. I've got Biotic Renewal. So potentially you are gonna undo everything I just did. Possibly. Renewal, four, five, six. Yeah, I'm back to four. <laughs> Get them back. Kill them all, eh? <laughs> all right, well, my next activation is... The Tempered Sorcerer. The Tempered Sorcerer. So he's in range to do some spells over here. Coruscation. Coruscation. So four or less, seven dice, one automatic success. I'm gonna burn some dudes here. Uh -oh. Come on, buddies. Oh yeah, so I just burn you. So that was really bad. I lose two more. I burn you. That was fun. Was it now? I like that. <laughs> my last one is my tempered steel shaper, who unfortunately is out of range of his magical abilities, so he won't do anything this turn. Yeah, at the end of round two, I score two points. Magic looms large, and Nick finally sunk home lasting damage. Coruscation hurts. Medium units coming in on threes. I get two of them. Any heavies coming in? Fives. Oh. I've got one medium on a three. Not coming in. And my heavy unit is not either. <laughs> Nothing came in. All right, I've got mine, uh, mine all set. Magic has been big in turn two looking for the meat of the forces to hit the field in turn three. I get plus one to the roll. Supremacy! Oh, I can do this, I can do this. I really want these guys to go and kill you. Yes! Oh no. You're about to die. Oh shoot. All right, so I'm gonna charge. So I lost total of four. You roll one failed resolve die. Somewhat disappointing. High clone executioner. Draw event. Turn the tide. And he's going to sensory augment. So that means he's going with the drones next. I get to look at the top card. Please stay next. Hmm. My drones are going to fight back. Four hits. And I save all of them. That's unfortunate. <laughs> the high clone executioner. Ooh. Or two or less which I get two of them. Three or less to uh, not take another wound. And I got a two. Beautiful rolling. My turn. I did the whole ballista. Aim, and then we're gonna shoot. Ready? Fire. <laughs> Seven wounds. Yeah. The character, he's gonna fire his shots. Reroll all misses. I did another 40. 
That was solid shooting. Wow. I like these guys. <laughs> All right, your turn, sir. Oh boy. All right, so now their turn. They're gonna move up. Double move. Double move. Well then, my next activation is the Tempered Sorcerer. The Tempered Sorcerer. And guess where you are beautifully in hey, range now. Hey, leave me alone. I'm gonna flame you to death oh, right here. Oh no. Flame on. Flame on. I saved two of them, three results. One of them, I get to re-roll another. Take a total of five. I believe, sir, that you are broken. Broke me. You, you took a lot of firepower. But now you get to go, and I bet you've got a guy that can just like regenerate all That's things. what he's gonna try and do. So he's gonna roll for his biotic renewal. Get a one. Ooh, roll the two. Oh. Mend flesh. I have biotically renewaled. That's really keeping you in the game the Fire Forge. So we're gonna move up. That'll get you at least a couple of stands in shooting range. All right, so the Fire Forge are gonna fire. <gasps> My character fires. Tells you that max range. I hit you twice. I'm not facing you, so my shields don't count. Ooh. So I lose two more. What else you got here? Avatar. Double move with my Avatar. Terrifying. Good thing I've got this here so you can't get through. Hopefully I'll be able to go grab some points. Last uh, card for me is the tapered shield steel shaper. Shield shaper. Shaper, tapered uh, person here. Uh, his magic ability is only getting units plus one to clash. Can't really do anything with him, so that's the end of my turn. Lineage Highborn, she can't do anything over there. Finally, my Vanguard clones, who Ooh. stayed to the very, very end so they could escape cannon fire. <laughs> Probably a wise move. <laughs> I'm gonna sneak on in here and hide behind this, this formation here. Sneaky, sneaky. And a turn. So now you got another two points. Another two points. Four. To zip. To zip. Good job. Hey. I feel like I'm winning though. Okay. You can feel that way all you <laughs> like. I feel like I'm winning because I'm having fun. Nick is falling behind in points, but seems unconcerned. I need to score quick before he blows me away. Star of death. So I take three hits. I ignore one of them and two guys down. Let's see if I resolve on that. Yes, yes. I'm good. You've got one medium coming in automatically. Automatically, my hold warriors are in. Same with my marksman clones, they're in. And we'll see if my leader, the hold, ah, with my hold thanes. No, they're not, because I rolled a one. I got to roll high. One. Hmm, I wonder what I need to do. Actually, I know exactly what I need to do. <laughs> In the supremacy. Yes! Ooh. I am going to use my coordinated assault so that I'm going to start with three of my units. That's okay. It'll put you in a better position for me to kill you. First action, first one is going to be these guys. Got it. Rally. Oh, because you're broken. Because I don't want to break again. I'm just going to march forward. Because you need to heal those guys so they don't die. Yes. So my second action is with the Biomancer, Biotic Renewal on his own unit. Get five Ooh. models back. Just five models. The unit in front of him. Oh, we rolled a six. So I'm going to get three models back there. Third, my other force going drones. I'm going to try and kill those. How much of? Character twos, and I've got five results as me. So I've got one wound remaining on this middle automata. Here we go. So hold ballista right here. I'm gonna move up and fire at these guys. Nope. I got them all. What? That's what needed to happen because I can't have that guy bring me back any more dudes. My high clone executioner, turn the tide. So I'm gonna activate this unit. They're gonna double march to get on to that objective. Well then, okay, so my next activation, the Tempered Sorcerer. He is in range to do some sorceress blasts oh, into no. the side there. Hurrah! Nine. But I don't think they're broken. I needed to kill one more guy. Yep. Lineage Highborn, back to you. So it's to me. The Infer the Automata. They're gonna inspire themselves, fight. Oh boy. Did it die? Nope, I'm okay. <laughs> well, not left? quite What's okay, left? but one leader <laughs> and a character with a full retinue. What's your next activation? 
That's the Avatara. Goes to you. They've already activated my tempered steel shaper. You can cast his ability to make them plus one clash. Ooh. And they now have plus one clash. Your turn. The Vanguard clones. Yeah, they're just gonna go straight forward. I activate the fire force. Reform the lines. And uh, move forward. Five. What do you got left? Got some incarnate sentinels. Oh, new, new stuff coming in. I've got one unit left to come on. The Hold Warriors. Oh, the Hold Warriors. You know what? I was going to put them here. But since he did that, I'm going to have to put them here. Because I can't have you charging my back here. <laughs> uh, which is unfortunate because that means I leave you that. They're going to wheel and move up to block your access. Bring it. Marksman clones march once, and then they're going to shoot. <laughs> Oh, three go through. I got him. You got him. I killed him. It scores you an objective. It really does. Good. It's going to score me two points. And I've got two wounds left on this last one here. Fantastic. And you are broken. That is the end of the turn. All right. You're going to score a lot of points this turn. I score four points. So one, two, three, four points for me. Bring your total to eight. Total to eight. I have four more to go. Spire merchants could not pass up an excuse to force the latest shambling clone creations to war. Reinforcement step in round five. We have heavies coming in. See what happens there. All right, so um, supremacy step. You take a hit here. You could die from this. Two or less. He's dead. Character gets to fight in death. Twos or less. He takes two wounds, which kills him. Bye-bye. The objective is open. Promise who goes first? So I'm gonna take first turn. Starts, he's not around anymore, he's dead. Excellent. So, my incarnate sentinels. Which are those guys. Oh, you're gonna charge right in. Oh yeah. So I don't need to roll for this charge. Ah, and here we go. Um, I saved one of them. One whole stand. Fire forward. I'm gonna move forward so I can test it. And they're just gonna fire everything into there. I hit you three times. Here's two. Character goes. And he hits you three more times. I evaded three of them. So three, three down. Clones. Vanguard clones. So these guys. Yep. So I'm going to reform. Reform the lines. And then I'm going to charge. Charge. You don't get to fight me, though. Nope. Inferno Automata. We're dead. So the whole ballista, all these guys are gonna shoot. <laughs> Two so far. And then the ones on your side. The character on your side, but no pierce. Five losses. Excellent. You don't have the objective. Which is frustrating. And then they will reform. Reform the lines. All right, your turn, sir. Marksman clones. Watches. Double march. I've got my tempered sorcerer. Ooh. And guess who's in range of his tempered sorcery? Uh oh. <laughs> oh. Two wounds. Your turn. Abomination! Ah! That is scary. So you managed to get in there, but unfortunately, we just contest this and nobody gets this objective. Right. right. We measured twice as this contested position holds the key to victory. You are only four points away from winning this game. That's right. I've got my uh, Steel Shaper. He's gonna try casting cl plus one Clash over there. Succeeds. My Avatar. These guys are kind of stuck, because if they move, they don't score. Well, I can move a little bit to make sure that if you get to charge on me, that you won't be taking my point Fair from enough. me. Unless I kill you outright. It's always that. They're like, yes, we have found the limbs. <laughs> All right, that's a little bit. It's what we were after, the limbs. But nobody has the head. There's a whole big pile of bodies over here. Oh, yeah, been... The Tomatar are just dead. It's all on fire, too. It's yeah. All... all right, my next action. I've got the Hold Warriors. My Hold Warriors! The Hold Warriors! Who are going to inspire themselves. Whoa. And they are going to have fury. Hit them! Of course he goes. Excellent. Uh, my turn. I got my lineage, Highborn! Who can't do anything. She's like, hello! <laughs> <laughs> All right, and then my turn. Um, and then I've got the Holdreich. 
Can't do anything yet, because he's on the board. He's off the board. And then it's your turn? Yep. Oh, they're dead. <laughs> and then lastly, the whole Thanes come on. They gotta come on right here. And they gotta double march. Ah! My Scottish accent is terrible. <laughs> it is very bad. Apologies to Finley if he's that watching. Is, uh, who is a real Scot with a real Scottish accent. Count up what happens. So. You got two points for over two here. Two points there. We can test here. No one gets this one. Which so, brings your score to 10. 10 and your score to? Zero. Nick, you've got to get on these objectives. All I have to do is kill you. Okay. I can hold this on. All right. If I can take you off these objectives, you're as good as dead. Next turn, you will either win or you will be one point away from winning. You either win this game or I manage to make it last for one more turn. Seven cards remaining. How many cards do you have remaining? Six. Oh, I need everything to go first. While you're in combat here, I have Bar of Death. Oh, I got two! All right, Supremacy. I'll go first. All right, who do you want to go first? Sentinels! This move was a mistake. Firing, Firing. and then clashing. Resolve test. So two. These guys are tough. They are really tough. All right, so my first, I actually did the whole thing. Nick kindly explains my mistake for me. There was a risk of you backing up with them. Yep. And if you backed up with them, I couldn't charge you. Yep. And if I couldn't charge you, the game's over. Yeah, I'm actually surprised you moved forward with you guys, to be honest. It looks like I need a one. That's not a charge, huh? I don't think I can fail that. So these guys charge in. All right, I'm out of range of the objective, so I gotta kill ya. Hurrah! And then five attacks from my king. Hurrah! Yeah, I'm wiped. I was so shocked, I forgot to fight in death. The tables have turned. All right, your turn, sir. That was a good, solid, just pounding. Smash. Yeah, that was deeply, deeply bad for my battle plans here. What do you got next? Vanguard clones. Inspire and fight. I like big heavy shields, they're fun. <laughs> Great. <laughs> Sorry, here you go. Uh, the Fire Forge. So now I get to go with these guys and hit you back. I am not going to inspire because I predict that I can kill them without inspiring, which will then let me move. And I hit you, oh, only once. I'm okay. Has Nick's luck run out? So perhaps this was a bad idea to not inspire, no. but I also have the character the sorcerer dude there, and he hits you three times. Save two of them. If I make my resolve test here. Ha-ha! <laughs> of course. <laughs> oh, no. Of course. Oh, no. Good job, dwarves. Humph. All right, so, ooh, I thought it was going to charge, but you know what? I got shoulder mounted cannon. Let's just shoot you. <laughs> I saved one. Abomination. The oh. charge! <laughs> now, if you can kill me off that objective, you win the game. That's true. All I need is two points to win. Two points. My abomination is my only hope. Impact hits. No, no, no minus here. I see them both then. My rolling continues to be abysmal. <laughs> I failed one. Okay. Yeah, so one more guy runs. So you managed to get two. That's okay. My no, turn. it's not okay at my all. Turn, my turn. Uh, the temporary shit. I can't duel you, right? No. Okay. Well, he'll cast on these guys to give you plus one clash. I failed! Well, oh well. Your turn. He's got ten points to my zero. All right, so you take the objective with your archers. This is where it gets really interesting because you count as five models there. And I actually only have four in range of the objective. That's right. So you're gonna take this objective unless I can kill you off of that. That's right. Because this will score you two points. So all this brilliant maneuvering here won't help me unless I can kill this freaking thing. Take down the abomination. He's only got seven wounds left. So what you're saying is this was a real big mistake when I shot you rather than charged you. Possibly. <laughs> so this is really my last hope. I've got a wheel, I've got to shoot you, and then my sorcerer's got to kill you. Sounds like a plan. I don't want to see this happen. All right, so my next activation is 
Hey, my ballista. Hey. There we go. So I'm gonna do exactly that. I'm gonna reform. Reform the lines. Chunk, chunk. Ready, men, bring it down. <laughs> Woo! So hitting on twos because I wasn't able to aim. Oh, oh not great. Oh. Well, we saved one. Okay. And then four from the character. Oh, I get to reroll all my hits because he's blessed. Blessed. And he hits you three more times. Any pierce? No. One more wound on me. Three left. Oh, oh no, no. My avatar is dead. My lineage high board oh, is dead. Oh, it wasn't me. You got nothing left. I got nothing left. All right. It all comes down to this. The tempered sorcerer. The tempered sorcerer. He focuses his mind. He realizes he has to do this. He gathers the energy into him. He does a cool twirl with his staff. That's what he does, right? <laughs> <laughs> he gets a lot of dice. Four, six, six seven. seven dice plus one automatic hit. Right, and you're hitting on four lures. Yeah. Oh, boy. Yeah. Oh. Hurrah! <laughs> Mass says I die. By one dice. Right. <laughs> so I need to roll four of these at a three or less. Die! You did it! I did it! You did it! Your dice finally came through for you! Oh At the last moment! Actually, they we're haven't needed. Oh, because you have to take a resolve test. Two wounds. Two wounds. And then you gotta roll two dice. So I have one wound left. <laughs> if one, five, and six happens, I'm dead. Yeah, this is great. This is great. I for, love games that end like this. For the game, Nick. For the game! For the game! No! No! He goes down! He erupts in flames! His head just kind of explodes. Only one point away, I was left without enough models to score any more points. While Nick enjoyed a commanding position. Spire concedes. Good job, dude. You saved the game. Because essentially- That was a nail biter. Yeah, because you score one point here, but between this, I kill this. <laughs> this doesn't end, end up changing the game at all. I score one. You score one, bringing you to 11. But I'm never going to score another point. Those twigs are so tough. <laughs> <laughs> but it was an entirely close game. Fantastic game, Nick. Well, thanks for joining us. This was exciting. Um, if you want to support the channel or get interested in this game, you can actually purchase this game through the affiliate link. You can see that in our description. There might be a link up here. Thanks to everyone out there having fun, playing Conquest, and getting involved in the community. I had a fantastic time. I'd like to play these guys more. You are a dweg master I so think far. So these are my favorite. <laughs> I know we've got more coming. Three more episodes planned at the very for least. For sure, yeah. For Actually, sure. I think we've got a couple of extra tidbits. We'll see. I saw a box. Did you? And it had like a T-Rex in it. Oh, did it now? <laughs> yep. So I am going to be putting that together and painting it up to try and wrap it in with the rest of those beautifully painted uh, miniatures from Drakkar. Well, until the next time we see you in the fantastic world. World of ER. Play on. Play on! Woo! <laughs> Wango for life!